Welcome to another exciting episode of The Million Dollar Peddlers. I'm Paper Goy. And I'm Mr. Magazine. And you're watching this today, and it's Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Got any happy, big plans happy today? Happy Thanksgiving. Eat a lot of food and watch the Cowboys win. Nice. That's it. Got to have a plan. Yeah. That's How about you? Uh... No, let me not guess. Really. You're working. I'm going to be gonna working. Sell yeah. stuff. I'm going to yeah. sell stuff. List. Yeah. Well, yeah. Get some CDs out of the car. I don't know if I'm going to go that far. <laughs> <laughs> so we wanted uh, today to wish everybody a happy Thanksgiving. We wanted to take today. There's so much negativity out there in the reselling community, um, and it's easy to get down. Um, you have bad sales for a couple of days, and you get down. I'm sure you yeah. do as well, Mr. Magazine. I know so, that I do. Yeah. Um, Today's a good day to be re-energizing yourself, uh, sitting down, recharging your batteries, and, and being very thankful for everything that reselling allows us. Um, you know, think back, Mr. Magazine, pre-eBay, um, when you just had the, the brick and mortar. If you continued in that route, and there are people out there, God bless them, uh, old-time dealers, generally speaking, that never embrace eBay. They never embrace yeah. online. They simply do things... Um, right. What they're comfortable with. They're, they're comfortable yeah. with, and for whatever reason, but they also make a living at it. Right. You know, would you be able... W would you still be in business, or would you be working for somebody else if you never embraced eBay? I don't like working for someone else. I may have no choice. If I'm still in business, I certainly would not be as successful as I am right now. Exactly. Exactly. And what, what has... Online selling, eBay, Amazon, your own website. What what has that allowed you? Um, give them a better life to my family. Um, get out of some debt that I was, you know, incurred years ago. Um, a better lifestyle, just you know, just to, to grow in a positive way. I think. Yeah, and just I mean across the board. Um, how many people have you have you met from from you know all of this? You you've made friends you know, doing yeah. the, doing the channel. We've made friends, sure. and thanks to everybody out there as well. Yeah. Um, there are a lot of opportunities that we absolutely would never have had had we not sold online. Well, even all the employees I've had over the years, I've given them jobs so they could, you know, afford to live and take care of their family as well. That's actually a really good point as well because back in the day, um, when you just had the brick and mortar slash laundromat, you had me helping you out from time to time, you know, watching the store, things like that. If you went away for a vacation, you'd have somebody watching the store. Mm -hmm. You might have somebody coming over and doing cleaning of the laundromat and that. And that was pretty much it. You right. had yeah. two-thirds of an employee, let's say, yeah. for yeah. lack of a better way. How yeah. many employees do you have now? Uh, Fifteen. Fifteen employees. Yeah. yeah. And it's all really because of online selling. Sure. Absolutely. How about even things like, you know, your collection? You've yeah. seen things that you've never, never even knew existed, and yet now they've they've passed through your hands. Yeah. Um, and let alone the other people in, that that we've helped, and you know, I, I don't want to sit there and, and blow our trumpet, but we do have a new section um, that this is going in. We have playlists set up on YouTube, and there are uplifting ones, and we I've kind of grouped them all together under uplifting. And for example, we had the um, the video we did a couple of months ago, uh, where a couple of times in a very short period of time, I went on house calls. You would give me the one, um, and I went on the other one, where the people were talking about how how the service that we perform as resellers. Yeah. Um, you know, we we help people when when they don't know what to do. They've got sure. a house full of stuff. They don't want to put it out to the curb. They don't want to put it back in the you know the landfills and mm -hmm. everything like that. Yeah. And they're happy it can be repurposed. You know, through resellers. Sure, sure. Um, and I've met some great people, great people doing this. Um, I I as well. When when I think back to when I started, I I, I knew nothing whatsoever. Um, and there's a there's a whole community mm -hmm. now. My community is probably a little bit different than your community because your community tends to be like the other car dealers, other brick and mortar people, right. and all that sort of sure. thing. Whereas mine are kind of the uh, the, the gypsies for and I, I'm part gypsy, so I can say that um, the gypsies that go around to the various estate sales, auctions, flea markets, and all that stuff. Right. You know, that's my group there because I don't have a brick and mortar store. Sure. I'm sure that if I if I opened a store up down the block from you, I'd be friends with all of those people as well. Right. Um, you know, but you made friendships, you help each other out, you, you throw leads their way, they throw leads your way, uh, you call each other with, with questions, problems, complaints, and I, I dare to say you made some friends. 
um, throughout this. Yes. Yeah, for sure. Um, and so on. And none of that would be would be available without all of this uh, online opportunities. Yeah, I mean, even friends out of state, there's you know dozens of them that I talk to on a regular basis, and they'll try and find me things to you know buy and so forth. So yeah, it's ongoing. Yeah, it's very very true. Yeah, that's a good point as well uh, as far as that goes. Um, so I want you today, while you're sitting there, you know, when, when you put your head down to say grace, if, if you're so inclined uh, today, I want you to just give a bit of thanks for what, what all of this uh, reselling affords us. Um, it isn't just the monetary, it's the friendships that you make. It's the, the fact that a lot of times we're saving history. We, we really, truly yeah. are. Um, things that otherwise would be in the landfill, things that people... You know, they're reunited with a toy that they had when they were a child. Right. You yeah. know, a book they read as a child, uh, anything at all like that. I mean, they're the prop they're using on a TV show or something. You know, we've had that both happen to us. Yeah, that's very true. Yeah. yeah, yep, yeah. Things that are needed to in order to entertain millions. And again, I I don't want to get too full of ourselves as resellers, all of us. I mean, we are just peddling used merchandise when you get down to it. But that being said, somebody has to do it. Uh, we we do it, and all of you watching it, we we do it fairly. And, you know, hopefully we're, we're paid fairly for all of the work that we do. Um, and, and take a moment, pat yourself on the back, and also be very, very thankful um, for what this all affords us and, and what we can do thanks to it. Um, so you have a happy Thanksgiving today. Uh, you spent time with your family today if you're, if you're so inclined. Um, if not, just say you're really, really tired after eating the turkey and fall asleep. Uh, do whatever you need to do today, but you know, take a day off and reflect. We should um, have a thank button. We should, yeah. Hit the hit, thank hit, button. Hit the thank button yeah. <laughs> and we'd also like to thank everybody out there as well who really, truly supports us. Uh, comments on the videos, and even even the people that don't comment, hit the thumbs up. We definitely do appreciate that. Uh, we want to continue to bring you more great content going, you know, going forward for the foreseeable future. So thank you very much, uh, everyone out there, and we will see you next video. Take care. Bye-bye.